this video, we'll focus on the administrator, who is responsible for modeling and configuring the whole solution. Specification management configuration is highly flexible, so it's good to understand this part first. Let's see which apps are available for the administrator. There are apps for defining, grouping, and filtering properties. There are apps for configuring composition-related data. And there is one app for defining specification types. There's also the Status Management app. It's a central solution, so we won't cover it in this video. The first recommended step for the administrator is to define composition. There are three value set apps and their grouping pairs. These are roles in composition, value qualifiers, and qualitative statements. It's best to define these first, since they're used later in composition properties. After defining these, let's create at least one composition item type. I'll create the type vitamins. Now, I can create a composition item, for example, vitamin C. Finally, I put it to a composition item group, which I associate with the vitamins type. After I've defined all required composition data, I need to add properties to the system. There are attribute properties and composition properties. I'll create a composition property now, for example, vitamin content. I'm choosing the newly created composition item group, then setting up which composition-related information is required for my property. In order to see this property within specifications, I have to create a specification type. Each specification has exactly one specification type, and this affects the properties the specification will have. I'll create the unpackaged product specification type. Now I have to create a property tree that will be associated with this specification type. I'll create property tree for food products. I could create one for healthcare products as well. I add all the properties I want to see for a food product. I nicely organize them under property nodes. Finally, I create my product category hierarchy, which can be useful for searching within specifications. Based on the product lines of the company, this process can look a bit different, but now you have an overview of the administrator's tasks.